Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts back once again with another reaction for you guys. Today guys, I'm checking out Avengers 2000 trailer fan made created by Dr. Flashpoint. Also, the title has Spider-Man, Wolverine, Hulk, Daredevil, Ghost Rider, and Punisher. Now, I saw the thumbnail for this video and it had the Hulk from 2003, Eric Bana's Hulk from uh, within the thumbnail. It also had Ben Affleck's Daredevil and I think Ghost Rider was there as well, but regardless, this concept sounds really interesting and uh, Dr. Flashpoint put out this video today, this fan made trailer for this uh, this this film that I guess he wants to happen, which would be really interesting if they did Avengers back in the day with these versions of the characters. Um, and then other fan trailer creators were tagging me saying you should check this out too. So apparently it's really fucking good. But then again, Dr. Flashpoint knocks it out of the park every single time he puts out a fan made trailer. So I am expecting some great shit here. So without further ado, guys, I'm going to stop rambling. Let's get into it now. Avengers 2000 trailer fan made created by Dr. Flashpoint. Let's get into now and see what he shows us. Let's go. Love his logo. Yeah, Tom McGuire. It's an old fashioned notion. Mm. Nick Fury, director of S.H.I.E.L.D. I'm here to talk to you about the Avenger Initiative. You become part of a bigger universe. Mm. Just don't know it yet. These people may be isolated, unbalanced. So does this mean you want a rematch? <laughs> But I believe with the right push, oh. they can be exactly what we need. I think it's something more. Something darker. Oh, Extremism. Batman. Batman line. Advanced idea mechanics. As if gamma accidents, radioactive bug bites, and assorted mutants weren't enough. Whatever it is, oh. somebody has That's to That's from it. outtakes. From an Avenger, uh, from Iron Man. That's right. <laughs> I need your help. Oh. We have to stand together. All of us. Oh. That was good. That was good. Oh. That's really good. Yeah. <laughs> Mm. Avenge us. That's cool. Yeah. The whole world's gonna hell. You just gonna sit there? Uh, oh, that Wolverine shot. You got me. That last shot was good. That last shot, though. Modoc too. God damn. Matt Reeves, a Batman trailer fan, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. I need your help. Look at that final shot again. Blade. Love you it. You got me? Love it. That is, that's really cool. That is awesome. So... Dr. Flashpoint knocks out of the park again. I love this concept. I like how at the end, at the end you wait to reveal Blade and then MODOK and everything, and then they're all staying there. Uh, and here's the thing, too. So, like, the beauty of fan-made trailers, I think, ultimately boils down to really only a couple things that make them really stand out amongst others. But, the, but why I think this is so good is because it's not over the top in terms of, like, having every single shot, having characters who were not in the same shot together being a shot together he was intertwining shots from the for throughout all these films that made sense and then like you had the whole thing was like you ready for a rematch or whatever from ben affleck's daredevil and then we had tom mcguire spider-man fighting that daredevil but it wasn't like they were like in the same shot and you had it like you know over the top it was just like a punch and then knocks him back it was not over the top that way but then as we get further into the trailer then we see some of that you know manipulation of will of the footage and having them stand together which has never happened in the films and like this this is so fucking cool this is really awesome and it just makes me go why imagine if they would have did this imagine if this if they were actually to pull this off it would have been the craziest shit ever but it would have been interesting 
it would have been really interesting because if they would have been able to tie in all of these different properties in some sort of way within a film as Avengers, it would have really blown everybody's mind of how many interconnected stuff because the way that these films really went about it, there was no real connective thing. And the fact that he used an outtake from Iron Man that never made it into the film, but they had it recorded where it was mentioned about Spider-Man, mentioning mutants in Iron Man 1 from Sam Jackson and Nick Fury. Of course, it was just, it was filmed and it was never used, but they released it. It's fucking cool. Then he made, then he made it work. And then he used some Batman lines from Justice League from the trailers and he put them in as, as that, that, that's Daredevil speaking. It's fucking great. Uh, I love it. I love it. It's it's such an interesting concept, and I'm glad that he did this because I would have never thought of like this being a thing to where we incorporate the original trilogy of X-Men films in terms of Wolverine. We have Ben Affleck's Daredevil. We have Nicolas Cage's Ghost Rider. We have Tony McGuire's Spider-Man. Ang Lee, I think that's the director, but Eric Bana's Hulk. Um... We also had um, the first Punisher movie. Well, not the... Oh, wait, when the, there was a Punisher movie back in the 80s, I think. Yes. I believe. Dolph Lundgren, am I crazy? Maybe, yeah. I think so. <laughs> I'm trying to remember. Um, but I think the actor's name is Thomas Jane, I think. Uh, his Punisher. Of course, we had Wesley Snipes' uh, Blade there. Then we have MODOK. Like, it's a lot of crazy shit. And this would have been really cool. This was a really thing. And, you, you know... They should make some sort of technology where we see something that's really cool that wouldn't that never happens and we can somehow envision our heads and make it within our heads. It's, I know I'm getting a little off topic here, making mentioning technology and shit that we can make this real, but we we'll never see this happen in real life. But it's just really cool that this was made because Doctor Flashpoint can deliver some fantastic stuff, and he delivered another really cool concept, and he killed it, destroyed it, awesome shit. What'd you guys think of this? trailer created by dr flashpoint uh, i honestly think it's really cool and I, I i wish this was actual this was actually a thing regardless if it was good or not at least it was something you know what i'm saying like if they actually made this but uh, i really like the trailer what you guys think of it let me know in the comments below guys i will talk to you guys soon and, and yes yes support dr flashpoint subscribe to him support him he deserves it link to this video will be at the very top description go subscribe to dr flashpoint talk to you guys soon peace out